What's going on guys? On my calls back again with another video. And today I have a unboxing video. I ordered a, a Hexome V3 clone off of Fastech a month and a half ago and I got here today. I ordered it in the idea of seeing if I would like it to then be like, oh, okay, well then I'll spend the money for the real one. But it ended up taking so long, I just couldn't wait and I ended up buying a real one, I think it was like a week, between a week or two ago. And this just got here today, so I figured why not do an unboxing video. So here we go. Uh, I think it was, what was it? 40 or 50 bucks in, in Canadian for it. Shipping is slow as crap, but uh, here you go. Here's the box that comes in. Comes in just like this. So yeah, here we go. I'm going to open it. All that comes in it is the hex home itself. Got a voltmeter here. It's got vent holes, and the only other thing in here is a little information card. Put that off to the side. I already took it out of the package, so there's already batteries in it. Let's see a little little light up there. It's made of like it's got like a rubberized finish to it. It's pretty heavy, especially compared to the Authentic. The Authentic's got a, like, like a brushed metal, slick kind of finish to it. This is like rubberized almost. The buttons are different too, like this button's really clicky, like this one's, it's weird. But yeah, um, show you the inside of the the sled, battery sled. This is where all the wires and crap are. It's just a little plastic piece. I don't know if we'll be able to get it. You see the end of there, but uh, in other videos I've seen that it was just held on by hot glue. I don't want to crank it off, but yeah. But yeah, I'll take the. My Vapresso Gemini off of this, off the Authentic. Put the Authentic away. Throw this on here. Show you guys how it works. I have it set to just over 4 volts. So here we go. I have a 0.33 build in here, and I currently am vaping on some some uh, witchcraft by Dark Sky Vapors. If you haven't tried them, you should go check it out. Uh, this is a Max VG juice, black cherry with ice cream. Awesome. Anyways, so yeah, this it uh, it actually worked pretty fairly well. And keep in mind that's only 30% of the way up the dial. It's only 4.06 volts. So I don't know. I don't can't do the math off the top of my head, but however many watts that would be. But it works excellent. So yeah, I would if you're if you're interested in a hex home, but maybe you don't want to spend the money to get one or you just can't afford one or whatever the reason is this would definitely be a good like one like option to get me I was gonna sell it but then I was like well I'll keep it and I'll just keep it as like a kinda like my 
everyday like out and about thing that I don't really have to care about if I get it scratched or do whatever you know what I mean so that's what I'm gonna keep it for it takes two 18650 batteries I have two Sony VTC 4s in here excellent batteries um, so yeah for the price it's excellent the shipping was really slow but the price you can't go wrong you know excellent mod for the price I guess it works great but yeah so I mean I would recommend it if you either don't want to spend the money or you can't afford like a real one or whatever the reason may be I would recommend it but if not if you're thinking about well what do I get the authentic or do I get the the clone I would go with the authentic hands down every time I love that mod took me a whole two minutes after getting it that I fell in love with it but yeah so yeah this is my unboxing video of this um, let me know in the comments below if you want to see like a you know month update of me using it or something like that or like an update video or if you have any questions post it down below uh, in the comments so yeah that's it for now until next time i'll see you guys later